Hey, Forge FC fans, it's Louis B here, your digital host. And once again, I'm joined by the head coach of Forge FC, Bobby Smirnionis. Bobby, uh, the schedule is officially out. You will open the season April 11th against Cavalry FC, a rematch of the CanPL Championship. Is it nice to start off against uh, a, a known rival? Yeah, I guess uh, with all the teams we know them, we know them very well from last year, but I think things are a little bit different. Um, once you get kicked off with a new season, you know, for us, it's, it's game one of 30. Uh, or what we think may be 30 game one of 28 and then we'll see uh, what's done after that so you know we'll just get uh, prepared for the season as per usual and I think it'll be a, a great uh, opening game not only for us for, for the league in the second year in a row. One thing we've noticed is that uh, you will play your first uh, two matches here at home at Tim Hortons Field is that you think because of the weather here the advantage that maybe hopefully in April it'll be nicer here than it will be in Calgary and further places out west? Yeah, we hope so. You know, the one thing we've gotten used to here in the in the spring is the wind and the, and different things like that. But listen, we love playing at home. You know, one thing we've done over this off season is looked at how we played over the season, both at home and away. And I think we were excellent here. So getting two games here to start off the season, I think, is is a very positive thing. Starting the season about uh, two and a half weeks earlier than uh, than we did last year for the uh, Canadian Premier League season, uh, do you see the the advantage of of starting earlier, or how does that change your kind of approach to to training at all? Yeah, I think when you look at it from the players and you look at how long off season is, uh, everyone's uh, ready to get at it. Everyone wants to get on the pitch and get the season going as, as quick as possible. You know, the one thing we look at the schedule, it's uh, it's a little bit lighter to to start the season in the first few months. So, you know, we've taken away a few of the, the midweek games that uh, obviously clogged up the schedule in those first few months. So it gives us a little bit more flexibility in how we go about training, how we prepare for the games. But uh, of course, uh, once the middle of the summer comes, it's going to get busy. Uh, we haven't seen the CONCACAF League draw yet. I believe that's coming in May, but we do know the Canadian championships will be played uh, on Tuesdays um, but other than that your games on weekends that's is that something that, that you see an advantage to having all the games here on a weekend yeah I think it's uh, it's excellent it's excellent for our team to you know just to just to know that and I think most importantly it's excellent for our supporters and our fans who I think uh, not I think I know are the best ones in this league they were behind us uh, throughout the whole season the guys love playing here at home and uh, the more we can get here I think the greater the environment will be and uh, it'll keep on pushing us along into what we want to be our, our second championship in a row. And when you look at kind of the schedule as a whole across the league, obviously there were some tweaks, lessons learned in week one or in season one. Uh, how do you feel like the league kind of reacted to, to what we learned in the first season? Yeah, I think the addition of Ottawa helps a lot. You know, it gives that that balance of the schedule and, you know, hopefully having four match days uh, uh, or four games per match day. And then just, you know, allowing uh, teams to go through a right cycle and, and playing uh, each other spaced out through the season. And, and also, like you uh, mentioned earlier, just having a few more weekend games and some five days in between games to get some more training done in the season. I think that'll help a lot, not only for us, but I think it'll help for the quality of the play that's on the field. And overall, that helps the quality of the league. And just one uh, more from a technical aspect, guys have been back. We've seen guys uh, throughout the stadium uh, just starting to feel like the season's right around the corner. Yeah, definitely. The guys are wearing orange this year, so we can't miss them in uh, in here. So we've got a little bit more color uh, in, the, in the dressing room with uh, with their gear. Yeah, no, it's great to have them back. Uh, like we said earlier, it's a, it's a long off season. The guys have done some good work just seeing, you know, how they're working in here on these uh, first few days have been excellent and everyone's just waiting to get on the pitch and get going. Yeah, we can't wait either. Thank you. Oh!